After a few months of intensive work, the KDE community is pleased to announce Plasma 5.10, which brings many improvements and features to your desktop. Due to the popular demand, we've changed to Folder View as the default desktop, which allows users to put whatever files or folders they want on their desktop. Spring loading in Folder View makes drag and drop files powerful and quick. When you search in KRunner, it can now list non-installed applications in the Software Center. The icon size in the Vertical Task Manager is now configurable to support more and more popular vertical panel usage cases. Speaking of the Task Manager, it's gained options for middle mouse click, so you can group and ungroup applications. Places jump list actions are available to the File Manager launchers, so Dolphin and Task Manager gives you quick access to locations like your downloads and your pictures. The Audio Volume applet has a handy menu on each device, which you can use to set the default or switch the output to a different port. Interactive notifications now support a context menu on previews, giving you access to actions such as open the containing folder, copy, and open with. It is now possible to resize widgets on the desktop by dragging on their edges and moving them with Alt-Left click, just like a regular window. Plasma menu launchers gained a new category for often used documents and applications. Lock screen has gained support for media controls, so you can switch between your favorite songs without the need to unlock your desktop. Discover Software Center has gained provisional backends for flat packs and snap packages. It's now possible to use the virtual keyboard on the login and lock screen. If you enjoy using Plasma, please consider donating to KDE so we can work together to continue to make the best free software possible.